what it is, what it do, cyber world. It's your girl, the one, the only, Ash Brown, and this is the Ash Brown Uncensored Show. On this program, I talk a little bit about everything. It may be pop culture related. It may be Ash Brown related. You just got to stay tuned to see exactly what I'm going to talk about. And today is a good day. Today is a good day. So, if I haven't told y'all already, I am leaving aviation. I'm leaving aviation for good. I've done the commercial. I've done the charter. I've had enough. I've really had enough. And you get to a place in life where you just want peace. You want peace. You want a good work environment. You want an employer that appreciates you. You want an employer that's going to do what they said that they're going to (laughs) do and not give you broken promises and dishonest work ethics. Mm. I'm not going to go into specifics, but now that I have the experience of being in a commercial airline as a flight attendant and then being a charter airline flight attendant, there are a lot of differences in it. A lot. And although I'm leaving on a bit of a sour note just because of how things have happened, I am very grateful for the experience. Very great. Very grateful for the experience because I know that it didn't have to be allotted to me. (laughs) I didn't have to have the experience of being with a charter airline. The number one thing that I will miss about this particular job is the people that we service. And I'm talking about our service members. We take service members and their families all around the globe, all around the globe. Like it's just, it's a crazy, ridiculous amount of travel that we do for the DOD. And I will miss those people (laughs) because dealing with those type of passengers compared to the commercial passengers that I was really used to, I will take a service member, any branch, any day of the week, Army, Marines, Air Force, Navy, Coast Guard. I will take all of those and then some because commercial passengers are something else, y'all. <laughs> it is something else. They are something else. It is something else. And I wouldn't even wish it on my worst enemy. I would never wish it on anyone. And um yeah, I just wouldn't. I, I wouldn't. So that is the one thing from the job that I will absolutely miss. The company that I'm leaving, they've got a lot of mechanical issues going on with these planes and I'll share with y'all what somebody shared with me well not somebody one of the mechanics they warned us about walking on a certain area of the plane in the aisle and we're like why he was like well you know there's a dip right there and I'm like okay that sounds dangerous and I was like well why hasn't the company fixed this why haven't they you know done some preventative care for this so that nothing happens and he then told me that well this has been reported on multiple times in the last few months but the company refuses to do anything until something happens so you mean to tell me that you've got settlement money but you don't have money to repair your own plane make it make sense Make it make sense. So for that reason and several others, (laughs) I have decided to depart uh, my aviation career. And like I said, I'm grateful for it. I got to travel domestically. I got to travel abroad in ways and countries and time frames that I would never have the opportunity to do on my own. Never. So I'm grateful for it. But yeah... Y'all, my flying day is about to be behind me, (laughs) and I'm okay with it. I am okay with that. So, 
just wanted to share a little tidbit with y'all. I hope that you're having a good week and that you are having a powerful, purposeful, and peaceful weekend. And I'm going to holler at y'all on the flip side. Deuces.